Hi, I'm Dr. Jeffrey Bland, the founder and president of the Personalized Lifestyle Medicine Institute and in the early 90s, uh, the founder uh, and conceptualizer of the Institute for Functional Medicine and the functional medicine concept. I want to say that uh, we're, we're moving ahead with our sixth annual Thought Leaders Consortium, October 12th and 13th uh, at the Tucson, Arizona La Paloma Resort, thanks to the joint sponsorship and collaboration with a number of extraordinary uh, visionary companies, one of which is Precision Analytics. We couldn't be more pleased to have uh, them as a partner as we move forward in this next uh, uh, evolution of uh, our development of the Institute and how we're trying to really take precision-focused, personalized lifestyle healthcare and move it into the clinic with more success. This year, we're focusing on a, t a concept that I think is really quite amazing and will deliver, I believe, uh, improvements in patient outcome. And that is the question of why is age the singular most common independent risk factor to all chronic diseases? You might say, well, we can't do anything about age. We're going to have birthdays come up whether we like it or not. But actually what we're starting to recognize is not chronological age, it's biological age that is the most correlated between cause and effect in these chronic diseases, which then bears on the question, how do you measure a biological age and what is biological age and once you understand it then what do you do to intervene and that is the focus of the 2018 Thought Leaders Consortium. A great component of that has to do with the metabolic orchestration and mastery of the endocrine signaling system through all of the various regulatory hormones that regulate cellular function at a functional level and we're very pleased that part of the functional endocrinology that is going to be discussed throughout the course of this meeting is exactly the kind of sweet spot where Precision Analytics has uh, developed the leadership position. So I think that there will be a very interesting interrelationship come the October 12th and 13th uh, meeting between how do we really precisely personalize lifestyle intervention and how does that relate to this evolving understanding of uh, functional endocrinology. So I hope you'll be with us October 12th and 13th in Arizona. I think it'll be a meeting that you'll be talking about later saying, I was there.